Okay, everybody. Uh, it is me, Lucky Zumi Gaming, and I am back with another video. So, uh, my last vi two videos ago. Uh, never mind. I by the time this video is out, I will have de deleted the video talking about the staff situation. I was in well guess what this is the account right here so and that staff member so i'm just gonna go a little bit more depth in depth for if anybody actually watched that video so that staff that same staff member said that that the host was the one who kicked me now the weird thing was, was that the host was Zane, and Zane was the one who trained me. And when I got trained, I accidentally used this account, and I messaged him, and he said it was fine. Well, again, that same situation happened where I forgot that I was using this account. I'm in right now. And yeah, uh, that's all I'm going to say. But, Zane, if you're seeing this, don't, please, like, don't do anything to me. I know that that was, that was your first session, I think. Thing. Or maybe, maybe it wasn't Zane who was hosting. Don't, it might have been somebody else, because I was in this, I was in Zane's first session, or my normal account, so, I don't know, but, Whatever it, was. Whatever it was, I'm done with that situation. Uh, we're gonna head out to Joe's, but in the meantime, this since this was built for the fire department, and that means it has sport mode. So, I can't launch it with traction control off, but this will have to do, and go. It's not slow. It's up to 70 pretty quickly, and I go about 70 down the highway, and that's 110. Back into normal drive. And there we go. Okay. Yeah, this is basically my filming account, if kind of, and this is like where all my friends are. So yeah, I use this account a lot. But you know, uh, oh. I don't know if Joe's is gonna. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, I don't know if Joe is gonna be here. You know, the owner. I think he, he might be here. Uh, I'll go drive around back to see if there's any cars back there. If he is even over here. Oh. No cars back here, which is kind of a surprise. There's always like a beater back here because uh, like nobody wants to see it, and he's always busy. So far, the only car that is here is Joe. I think that's Joe's Silverado, the green Silverado. I don't know. It's not a hybrid. Oh, let's, oh, I can see in somehow. Nobody's waiting. I think I might be the only one here. Well, besides for whoever owns that Silverado, if that's Joe or if that's, like, one of his employees. Or they just did a job on that Silverado. But who knows, that might even be stock. 
Uh, not really sure what I should do. I might think I'm just gonna work it right there. Okay. There we go. Uh. Ooh, that's close. Anyways. I'm going to go talk to Joe. Joe, are you in here? Just not in here. Uh, just the... Uh, Joe? Swore that Joe was here. It's a little awkward. Uh, oh, uh, I'll just call him, see if he answers. I think I'm just gonna get back to you once I'm done. Okay, so off camera, uh, like after I uh got my Hummer, I took it. Uh, apparently the owner, the last owner, didn't me tell tell me that it needed an oil change. So I had to come back and get an oil change, and it's back. And I also had to do the missions thing, now that it's 2022. Oh, by the way, Happy New Year. <coughs> oh, that's just me choking on water, as as you do. Uh, oh, sorry about that. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna... I'm gonna t think. Well, now that I have a. Well, I think. Uh. I think I know where I want to go. And now that it had. And since I've got a sport mode in it. That was just a little baby pull. I'm gonna do a full send launch down this road. And that's 60 breaking. Breaking in this is actually quite nice. And hit fifth gear at around like 72. Something around there. And I'm gonna do full send down this road because no cops ever drive down this road. Top speed on it is 107. It's kind of slow. But then again, I this this is like a well now that it's. 2022, it's a quick math here, quick math, a 15 year old truck SUV, whatever you call Hummer, it's, I know it's an SUV. By the way guys, who is excited for the new Hummer EV coming out this year, I think? Uh, I mean, I've always, since I even heard about the Hummer EV, I've been excited for it, but now that it's officially coming out, I'm even more excited. Like this year, I'm, I mean, I don't know. If I ever do, if I ever, when I'm old enough, uh, when I'm old enough to get a car, or, and when I can afford a car, do you, I don't know what to, and if I even can afford the, a Hummer, uh, EV, what Hummer do I get? Oh, I'm colorblind, by the way, so, like, I think that's great. Yeah, definitely. Okay, uh, <laughs> no, that, that was a joke. Uh, you know, I was really going off of no couple of stuff, but, you know, so that's an excuse for if there was a couple there was not so uh yeah it's snowing out this car is so slow even normal drive this is oh a 
bring it through the consumer wash. I just, I just realized my only non-purple vehicle is my, is my uh, 370Z. But that's because I like the heritage paint scheme. I'm gonna get back to you guys tomorrow when I get my uh, F-150 back. Okay guys, so my Uber just left and I, well, let me go pay the bill. Uh, Joe? Why does Joe keep on leaving? Well, Joe's Silverado is still parked outside. Yes, I confirmed that is his Silverado. Uh, don't copy down his plates, but uh, rims, kind of like him. Yet he, he does not have a bed cover. Thought he did. But, oh. What the? They just brought out my brand new F-150. Right here, it's a 2014, it's an XLT. Uh, wow. Uh, they did a good job on the wrap. So this is inside the bed. It's uh, black. So then you see here we got these rims. I These are aftermarket. Got them for kind of cheap off of Marketplace. Uh, did a little bit of some I also got you know all the XLT features uh, yeah it's pretty cool uh, sounds the same only different thing is you know you hit there's no lights no antennas no no sirens, no nothing. And I added the feature, well, I added the button to turn off traction control. So now I can do a proper launch. So let me show you the lights. They're pretty much the different. They're pretty much the same. Uh, yeah, they're not LED, but uh, yeah, there's a sport mode on it, like like I showed before. So let me turn it around. Sounds the same. No aftermarket exhaust or anything. Wanted to put one on, but I didn't. Same top speed, same speed in general. That was 90. I got it. I'm going to turn back on traction. I just realized that I shut off my automatic lights. Yeah, this. It's. A pretty nice truck. Right. Oh, and let me turn back on my lights. Sad. I wish that in Greenville they made it a feature for automatic lights to turn on when it snows, but they don't, so I do it manually. Even in normal drive mode, it's not that slow. Like, like you know, accelerating from a traffic light, like I would. With cars behind me, I would put it in sport mode until I got up to like 50 and then I'd put it back in normal drive and go the rest of the way. Uh, lake. Let's go to the lake. Yeah, this is my new... Kind of, it's not really winter beater. My Hummer is my winter beater. Yeah, that, that's my winter beater, but then this is, like, my, this is my work truck, because my Hummer is my winter beater, my, uh, my CRV is still, 
Oh, by the way, great news. I think that I can keep my CRV when the update comes out. When the update comes out, I don't know. It's supposed to come out this sometime this week. So I'm excited. Uh, definitely going to do an update video. Uh, probably going to either drive around this in it or maybe drive around like my Honestly, I don't know what I'm going to drive around. Because, as usual, nobody knows what the update is. Because they don't really release that kind of stuff. Except for the, the live snowfall event they did. But that was so that everybody could, you know, get on and do it. Sadly, I, would, I had to go to Scouts that day. And it was at that time too, so it was not because I'm because I live in the in New York, which is Eastern Standard Time. So yeah, reason why we're going over to uh, Lake is. Okay, that was just a quick little, you know, pull. It is not only some good shots and it's I can off-road this thing properly, not just ripping down a back road. Ooh. Oh yeah, sadly I did take off the ram bar. I wanted to keep it on because Brody can't drive. Okay, this this is a this is an F-150. This is even like the XLT nice model. This isn't... I didn't cheap out on go for an XL conversion. And I converted Fire Rescue. Not only was it like already pretty specced out with the whole Fire Rescue thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. I almost just fell. Oh yeah, I think I need to take this on the ice. I didn't take my Hummer on the ice. I might need to. Whoa, okay, here we are. Wow, that's... I'm gonna leave it running with my lights on. can get a little shot there. Get that out of the way, and then go take a screenshot. There we go. So this is, it's a pretty nice view up here. I think that's going to be it for today's video. Stay tuned for my next video. It's either going to be an update video, or, or it's going to be me buying... Or, or it's going to be me buying something. Uh, and I'm going to tell you this, it's going to, it, if I buy what I plan on buying, it's going to have the same top speed as my Heritage, three seven, my 2019 Heritage Z, 370Z, uh, yeah, that that's all I'm gonna say. Whoa, okay, okay, okay. Help me, help me, help me. Oh. Uh. Okay, uh, one sec. Okay, so I just came over here to where I kind of fell. Uh. Gonna do this here. Okay. So this actually is kind of weird. This truck has, well, I, I forgot to mention this, but all my vehicles now have paddle shifters. Yes, I put paddle shifters in here. Come on, come on, come on. Lose grip, lose grip. I'm losing grip, I'm losing grip. Hey, that, that wasn't too bad. It's all wheel drive. 
the, yeah, so all my vehicles have paddle shifters. Why did I do it? Is why, because not only can I redline them and, you know, break the transmission. Oh, that wasn't too bad. I think I need to do some e-brake drifting. So yeah, if you're excited for some e-brake drifting, like, <laughs> that wasn't too, ooh, that was bad. I wanna go find the nuke. I think that they got rid of the nuke. Oh my, ow. I jumped out and then got hit by my <laughs> 150. Yeah, uh, I already got it registered and everything. I didn't put any vanity plates on this just because, like, it's my work truck. Well, now it is, but, uh, wasn't going to be originally, but with my, but with my Hummer only having as much space as an SUV, because, you know, it is an SUV. It just wasn't, I need it, and that's now my winter beater. Like, that's what I'm going to drive around when we get some bad blizzards. Oh, 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 counter steer. Oh, that didn't work. And then do a little bit of some of this, and then, and then counter, counter, counter steer. It's hard to do in a all-wheel drive truck. And do a little bit of some counter stick count. Foot is to the floor. This thing cannot, this thing cannot drift. Oh, uh, I forgot to mention, Grody just brought over my, my uh, CRV and my Hummer. Well, my my Hummer is right here. Whoa, how did that? It, he just got here. Wow. Okay, uh, manual and go. And just do a little bit of some e-brake drifting. There we go. There we go. And do an e-brake drift. Ah, uh, this it cannot drift. You know what? That that's the end of today's video. Thanks for watching. For the few people who stick around, please join my garbage Discord server. Yes, I'm announcing it on camera. I have a Discord server. Nobody has joined except for my friends and their and Mr. Smalls himself did join. Uh. I'm hoping here, I'm hoping that I can get, you know, some, I'm hoping that I can get, like, somebody to join, but thanks for watching, goodbye.